fingerprints that are on the ground at Bhumi Mudra. I'd like you to lift it up in a fearless mudra into an Avaya mudra. When your hand opens up, your left hand opens up like a, yeah, wide open. So the hand that was on the ground, Avaya mudra, fearless mudra. The thumb is right up smack next to your fingers. Smack next to it. Okay. We take this moment to um, invoke through our shared gathering, the ceremony. And then universally, and of course personally, I want you to, today to stretch your courage, to be bold, to be absolutely fearless. This is the Abhaya Mudra. Not holding on to anything. Breathe in. And then breathe out. Keep your legs a friendly shake out, please. I'm just getting to know your harmonium. We are having our first date. Feet to the ground. You want to move it back? Is it okay now? For me, it is. Yeah. If you think I'm going to knock it over, <laughs> hips up to the sky. Let's start in altar pose. Feet down, hips up. Hands behind you. Yeah. Tabletop. Deep breath in, family. Let it out. Whatever it is, it's out. You need to let out. Maybe some crazy secret. You know. Sink your hips to the ground. Cross your shins. Come on to hands and knees in the other direction. Sit back on your heels for a moment. Take a breathing moment and a big uh, fond heart opener. So you'll start your hands on your knees. If your knees are uncomfortable, double up your mat or something, okay? From here, inhale slightly hands up. Elbows get bendy and heart explodes. And then exhale, go on the other hand. And then find your rhythm and your breath in the yelling moment. And exhale, take it down. You want the eyes to close so the third one can open. Make sure you take some moments to go inside. To retrieve your spirit, to connect with your spiritual nature through this very funny bodysuit that we are wearing. more times. Your breath, your rhythm, and then link up to the, the big one, the big rhythm. The spanunda. Mm. Last time. Big breath in. Puff your hearts up. And hang that on to hands and knees. And then open up your legs. And down the right face. Pop your right leg up into the sky and then inhale. And step right up into the lung. <coughs> right arm up into the sky. Just a right arm up. Left hand down. I promise I'll do my best to guide you. That's all I can do. So if you are willing to pay attention, apparently it's our endless work to pay attention, then uh, Breathe in and breathe out, and uh, we build on our time together. Downward facing dog, step it back. Get nice and long in your plank pose, your breath in. Knees to the ground, hips to your heels. Let yourself be brand new like you've just been born. Hips to your heels. Spring out into cobra, spring your hips off your heels. Big heart, find your breath in. Up and away, downward facing dog. Breathe in, ride your, ride your breath up. Pop your left leg up like a big whoopty, breathing in, and lunge on your exhale. Roll it in so you brighten up your belly. And let's twist. Let's open up to something that maybe we can't see right now, but with time we're able to see. Usually the things that are right in front of us, these are very difficult to see. Let's right, 
back in front of us. Up and away, downward facing dog. Step it back. Your breath. Nice and long for plank. Child's pose. It's time to keep your toes tucked under the child's pose. And spring in the chaturanga. Spring that up. That's it. Lower down. If you need the ground, take it. Open up your hearts. Big breath in. Good. Hips to the sky. Downward facing dog. 